Hi, I'm Patricia Allingham Carlson, and this is my video of how I painted a day at the beach. Many people really enjoy a day at the beach, laying in the sun, playing with the waves, looking around, relaxing, looking at people, the seagulls, the gentle wind. It just is a lovely place to spend a day. As you look around the beach, you see all kinds of different people and families having a really nice time. And this was something I decided to do for fun. A little cartoon caricature of all the different kinds of people you might see at the beach if you're standing up on the top and looking down, planning where to put your towel and your umbrella. Hope you enjoy it and give it a thumbs up. Now let's paint. I tried to mark out some areas with a white Conti crown to preserve some whites. I found out that didn't work. I began this painting with a loose wash of color in the sky. I wanted to make some clouds and keep it nice and simple. Clouds lose their edges very well and appear quite fluffy when you paint wet on wet. But you still might have to work the edges with a damp brush to keep them nice and soft looking. That color was pure cobalt blue. With water, I mixed together some hooker green dark and some indigo. I'm painting in in a dry manner here and I'm leaving strips of pure white to try to show the ocean breakers. And next, the crowds of people on the beach. I mix up a big pool of different colored skin types for people and just start painting in little figures and little heads. To try to show the perspective, they're much smaller as we get toward the ocean and slowly grow bigger as they move away from the ocean. I'm not fussing or taking a whole lot of time here. I can add to these figures. I could take away from these figures. And I sort of like this nice loose approach because it helps the figures look more natural and relaxed. I'm painting people in clumps, people in pairs, and people in single form. And once I think I have enough of the people on, I'm going to start in with lots of bright colors for umbrellas and clothing and beach towels and beach cabanas and different kinds of structures. Here comes the umbrellas. Now you're going to see I'm using all different colors for the umbrellas because this is one of my primary color catchers here. And I want it to look bright and festive. Once I have a color on my brush, I'm going back and making some towels and some blankets for people to be sitting on as well. Here and there, I'm putting in some hair on the closer figures where the hair would show. I'm using a variety of colors and going all around the paper to try to show the different bright colors and spread them out. 
And on a whim, I just painted in a kite. The beach is beginning to grow crowded. I'm filling in blank spots with different people, adding a little bit more of my bright colors. And next I'll be letting it dry and going in with my fine tipped pen to do some detailing. I got a splatter up in the sky by accident and decided to make it into a dragon kite. Adding a few more details to the figures that are up close to the front. Putting a bathing suit on a woman up in the front. And now I'm checking out my different pens because I want the thinnest line I can get. This is a very loose, sketchy approach to this particular kind of drawing and inking. I am not fussing. I am just showing basic shapes, particularly far away and off toward the ocean, the people are specks. At this point, the concept of overlapping becomes a little bit on the crucial side because the people in front of the distant figures have to be clearly outlined so they can keep their place in a closer up position. Sometimes it's good to do them first and then do the umbrellas and the blankets that are behind them. One of my focuses here is to be spontaneous and to make different kinds of people representative of the many different people that go to the beach. We have folks of all ages, of different body types. We have children playing and we have adults chatting. And we have people getting sunburns as the man with the shaved head in the very foreground is busy working on. I'm keeping this loose, like I said, and I do enjoy cartooning and making comics and caricatures of people. It's a lot of fun. Sometimes I'll put myself in there and poke some fun at myself, too. The beach is a place to have a wonderful time, to feel the breezes against your skin and just relax and not worry about too much else. And that's what I'm trying to do here and having a lot of fun as I do so. A little bit of fine tuning with some color on my brush, some bathing suits, a few more beach towels, some detailing in the foreground figures. And a little yellow sand showing through. I sign it and it's done. I hope you enjoyed watching how I painted the day at the beach. I hope you'll give it a thumbs up, click on subscribe, and ring the bell below so you don't miss any future videos. There's some links below to click on too. There's links to my art page on Facebook, my blog, some products I use to create my art, and my own art products page for purchase. Your comments are always welcome.
Thanks for stopping by to watch my cartoon, and I'll see you next video.